Nobody really knows how society ended. Nobody cares anymore. It doesn't really matter in the long run. All the politics, all the wars, it was for nothing. People like me were cast into a world for which we were unprepared. I found comfort in the only thing I could, drawing. Capturing a moment just the way I wanted it to be captured. This was my freedom as an artist. I lived a steady lifestyle, alone in this abandoned city. Then the fateful day came, when I met him. Uh, I'm assuming you don't want to hurt me because if you did, I'd already be dead right now. That's right. So what happens now? We talk. So let's talk. I'm guessing you're just passing through. Headed west? That's right. What about you? Where are you going? Nowhere. I live here. Say what? Nobody lives here anymore. This place is abandoned. That may be, but to me, it's home. Well, to me, you seem insane, but this is about the tastiest thing I've had in a while. I might stay a while. You got a bed? What do you do to pass the time? Actually, I'm an artist. Really? Portrait? Landscape? Pretty much anything. See, now that's cool. You know I used to draw. Really? Why'd you stop? Probably not what you're expecting. My old sister, she, uh, she told me it was a waste of time. So? So I stopped. You should start again. No, nah, man. And got the initiative. Well, if you're interested, start by drawing trees. All right, man, so tell me the whole story. Tell me the whole story. I mean, why are you standing in this dump? Well, it's not really a story. It's just my home. No, I had a home too once. Sometimes you gotta move on. That's what my sister told me. I wish I could think like that. I just don't have the courage to. But you know, man, no matter how many good memories you have in the place, you can always leave and make some new ones. Someday, man. Someday. You know, I just have a good luck charm. Yeah? What's that? You're, uh... You're gonna think this is totally stupid, but... Have you ever heard of a dream catcher? Yeah, yeah, those are the, um... The things with the beads and the web design stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> One of those things, uh... My sister actually made it for me. It's, uh... It's supposed to repel evil spirits and, uh... Takes me where I need to go. Yeah, is that so? Hasn't failed me once. Yeah, whatever, man. Well, can I see it? <laughs> I'll, uh... I'll show you that another day. It's, uh... It's pretty embarrassing. Can't wait. <coughs> hey man, you uh, you okay? <coughs> I'm I'm good. I'm good. <coughs> it's uh, it's getting pretty late. Do you want to head back? <coughs> no, no, man. You go on ahead, I'll catch up with you. All right, man. I'll catch you later. I'm not sure why I gave him that drawing of the tree. I guess I wanted to inspire him. It didn't really matter, though. I woke up the next morning, and he wasn't there anymore. He had left something for me. A gift. A dream catcher. I remembered his wise words and how his dream catcher always led him where he needed to go.
Our lives are filled with fantastic opportunity. We need to embrace it and continue on, no matter how scared we are. This life is a life worth living.